uh, snapshot of the region. It started with uh, Colleen's father, Walter Hardwick, uh, in the 1970s when we first got the livable region strategy going and the urban futures was uh, first put together by Dr. Hardwick, who of course was a, uh, a very famous and uh, renowned urban geographer at UBC who did the uh, first uh, urban futures project in 1973 and that provided the information that we needed from citizens to help put in place the first uh, de facto livable region strategy. And uh, uh, the technology and the techniques at the time were pretty straightforward. It was trying to get and talk to people, which you can do in those days. Uh, and, and they answered the door and they actually talked with you. And uh, that was updated, of course, in 1990 when uh, then Mayor Gordon Campbell uh, had uh, Ken Cameron, who was the director of, uh, of uh, planning for what we then called the Greater Vancouver Regional District, uh, to go forth and gather the opinions of the people of the region on what they liked, what they didn't like, uh, what they'd like to see changed uh, as part of becoming one of the most livable regions in the world. And uh, that was published in 1991 uh, and uh, led to the Growth Strategies Act that we introduced as, uh, as government, which legitimized a, a different role between, more collegial role between the province and municipalities, and more of a partnership than creatures of the provinces uh, that uh, some people think municipalities are. And we're here today to say that it's time to update uh, with the uh, third 20-year uh, look at the region and engage citizens and use modern technology. And what we are going to do is give a demonstration from Calling a place speaks, which is an extraordinary new tool that uh, came from her work with her father. Um, and out of her mind, and Ken and I were entranced by this way of engaging citizens in the comfort of their homes using the internet uh, without having to go to public hearings or uh, where it sometimes gets pretty polarized, or to be reached by uh, the usual surveying methods, which are very hard to do and very hard to. Uh, show that these are the actual people that are at that address. So I, I wanted to be here to uh, say we're quite excited about this new approach to engaging citizens. We think it's going to change and open up opportunities for people to participate more effectively in our democracy.